Hey guys, so welcome to Boba Talk episode number two. In today's video, we're gonna go to hands down my favorite store, AKA Target. And there's a few things that I wanted to get and I'm sure there's gonna be a few things that I didn't plan on getting, but we might end up getting anyway. So welcome back to episode number two and I hope you enjoy. By the way, I love this hat. It's so cute. I got it from Brixton a little while back, but oh my God, with this fit, oh freaking love it so cute all right as you can see at target now let's go in ever at Target and see these, I would highly recommend trying them. These are super delicious. This is the one that I get specifically. Always gotta stop by the Funko Pop section at Target to see if they have anything good. This one's cute. This freaking pillow is really cute too. I really like it, but I'm gonna pass on it today. But yeah, I saw this and thought it was really cute. It is from the brand. It's from the brand Pillow Fort at Target. I saw this one. This one's really cute. I kind of want to get it. Just a cute little plant. How much is it? Five dollars. I found this really cute black bath rug. And the one we have right now is kind of crap and you can't close the door over it. So I might get this one. Just like a nice, simple one. I like the pattern. I'm gonna head home, make some boba, cause I actually bought boba to make at home, which is really nice, so I had to go out and buy it. So I'm gonna head home, make some boba, and then show you guys what I got. All right, I'll see you guys when I get home. This is the boba that I was talking about from Boba Bam. This one you can get at Costco and it's really good. So I would recommend trying this one if you guys see it at Costco.
Voila at home boba. Okay, boba talk episode number two. In today's video, you guys saw I went to Target, my favorite store, and we're gonna do a little Target haul similar to what I did in the last episode, Boba Talk episode number one, where I did a Daiso haul. So we got our boba, this time made at home, and it looks pretty good, if I do say so myself. Mmm. Basically a brown sugar, matcha latte. All right, so I'm pretty sure everything that I showed you guys at Target is everything I got. Um, I don't think there's anything that I didn't show, but I'm still gonna go over it and show you guys each thing I got. Um, starting with this guy right here. This is a fake plant that I got um, from the brand Threshold. It's a potted faux plant. And this one I thought would just be cute to have on my desk at home. You know, being indoors all day working, it's nice to have some kind of resemblance of the outside. And I thought this would be a nice addition to have. I've been thinking about getting, you know, some kind of indoor fake or real plant. So I thought this would be good. Not too big, not too small, just good to have like on my desk, like I said, or on the counter. So this is item number one that I got. And I need to remember to actually drink my boba in these boba talk episodes because last time I got so ahead of myself and so excited that I just forgot, so. Mm. Next item that I showed you guys that I got is this black bath rug right here. This is it. And currently with the ones we have, kind of got messed up from how I washed them, so that's my bad. But also the annoying thing is, is like the bathroom door. I'm on door to the bathroom. There's two doors to our bathroom. <laughs> but they don't make it so the doors can like easily go over the bath rugs because they're so thick. So hopefully this one doesn't have that issue. It's not too thick, so I think it should work, hopefully. Update on the bath mat that I got at Target. Can actually easily close the door and it doesn't get stuck so that is a successful purchase sweet and i also just like the black color of it this one is a 20 inch by 34 inch bath mat and it says that it's antimicrobial which helps with odor and helps the mat stay fresh longer so that's really nice that it's antimicrobial so yeah this is a brand new one that i got there you go couple other things I got not exciting but we needed new Ziploc bags so I got this one right here just the up and up target brand these are always good to have so yeah picked up a restock of that and we can never have enough plates in our household so I made sure to restock on some paper plates because I can't be bothered to keep up with washing the dishes. And these are always nice to have throughout the week when I'm lazy, which is a lot. So like I said, I don't have to keep washing dishes and can just have these to easily use and throw away. Now this is a really short and sweet, kind of like me, um, boba haul. Not a boba haul, a Target haul. But this is a short and small Target haul. I didn't get that much, wasn't trying to spend a lot of money in this particular target run but a couple more things that i got is these clorox wipes we were down to our last few here at my house so i restocked on that to make sure that we're ready to go whenever these are needed pause for boba mm, that's really good for at home boba you guys need to go to costco and get that boba that i showed you guys and the very last thing that i got is a food item and it is this sourdough bread from this brand that i get all the time you can see here it's called san Luis sourdough this i think you can get at a lot of stores i got it at target today obviously but this is just like some solid sourdough i also like the sourdough that comes in a blue bag i believe from trader joe's that one from trader joe's is honestly better than this one but target and you know just ordering off like instacart and stuff like that is a lot more accessible so i tend to go with this one right here and never disappoints solid thing of sourdough bread and i love my sourdough bread for my avocado toast that's like the main reason that i use it and also just making sandwiches so yeah that is everything that i got from target tonight and when i went like i said not a lot but just enough to curb my target 
craving to go there and get stuff <laughs> but the total that it came out to today was 41.35 and also i have a target red card target debit card or, um but that's always nice to have because if you shop at target a lot you get some money off each time you go so yeah i use that it saves me a little bit of money each time i go so would recommend that as well that is everything i got in my target haul today i really hope you guys enjoyed episode two of my boba talk series i just love this idea you know i love boba and i can combine these videos to really just talk and do whatever you know interests me in that time and um, today it was a target haul last time it was a daiso haul where are we gonna go next what are we gonna talk about next to be determined but that will definitely come up in the next episode so stay tuned to see what i do in the next episode of boba talks i really hope you guys enjoyed and if you did enjoy this video please don't forget to subscribe it would mean a lot to me and leave a like on this video i'll see you guys in my next one all right take care bye one more thing I got, but I think it is in my car and fell out of the bag is jasmine rice. Not exciting, but that was another thing I got from Target that I thought I'd mention. All right, peace.